welcome to my channel. So today I am super excited to be unboxing and trying on my fashion box for January of 2023. Now, if you're unfamiliar with Fashion, they are a clothing styling service. It's not a subscription box and that you can go out and make a request at any time for your clothes. So you don't have to commit to a subscription like some other clothing styling services. But right now they're doing their sale boxes only, which is really, really cool and a great deal. They did send this one to me free for review, but basically you get five styled pieces for $95 point blank. So it's um, a little bit different for their sales boxes. So that includes your styling fee and free shipping. Their stylist will style you in two to three days, but you will not get a preview like you normally would. Um, and it'll be selected based off your preferences and the newest and latest trends. Um, and it will ship for free with those, like I said, with no additional styling fee. And these are su final sale boxes. So this is a little bit different from what their subscription has been in the past. I think that they're looking at their business model. So it's possible it will change in the future. And right now, they're only doing these sale boxes, but I think honestly, it's a really great deal to get five pieces for $95 that's styled, it's shipped to you for free, um, and you do get to keep everything inside. There's also no limits as to how many sale boxes that you can order, so you can order, if you really like the one you get, you can order another one um, and see what you get. When you sign up, you do fill out a profile and all those kind of things, and then you do also um, submit, like you do with others, like a note for your stylist as to what you wanna get in order to order this. So I think that this is is a great deal. I'm excited to dive inside. I have, well, I have a slight idea of what I'm getting because I did go in and like complete it, complete. It'll tell you what to do um, to basically, you basically put that you want to return everything so that you don't get charged. But when you, the box is delivered, they send, they email you instructions on how you should check out for the sale box. So I'm really, really excited to dive into the box. The box is so cute and it says better as I am. So cute. Welcome back to all the sub box lovers out there and welcome if you're new. My name is Katrina and on this channel, I unbox lots of different subscription boxes, including fashion, clothing, styling type boxes. Boxes. So if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on future uploads. And let's dive in. I am so happy that you're here hanging out with me today, checking out what I'm getting in my fashion box. I am going to try the products on. First, we'll go through everything in the box and I'll kind of hold it up and then we'll do a try on to see how it works. Again, because these are final sale, it's not like you can ship it back if you don't like it or it doesn't fit right and all that kind of stuff. Um, but I do think that it's really fun. It's like a fun box of clothing. And I think, like I said, it's at a really good price. When you open up the box, that is what it looks like. So when you open it up, you do have a note from your stylist here. I'm not going to read it because it gives away some of the pieces. It shows you everything inside. Um, and it tells you exactly how to do the checkout for the, um, for the sale boxes since it works a little bit differently. All right. And when I pull out my bundle, that is what it looks like. All right, the very first thing is stripey and blue. What are you? Um, this is, oh, it's a, like a really lightweight cardigan. That's what the sleeves look like there. It's not, it's it's really soft. It's very lightweight, and like a nice lightweight t-shirt material. Um, it does have some like dark blue pockets on it. This feels really, really nice. It's kind of long, so I feel like it's gonna cover my butt. This is honestly perfect. It's from Lay Ami um, and is a navy ivory. I really like this. This is great because honestly, sometimes when I'm working from home, I get a little bit cold and I need to put something on. When I'm, at, when I'm at work, I'm always wearing a blazer, but when I'm home, I like to throw on a cardigan or something like that if I'm getting a little bit chilly. And this one is really nice. It's like stretchy and soft and look, just is super duper cozy, but also looks like it's gonna be super cute as well. So excited to try this on. Up next, we have this. Ooh. This looks fun. Oh, is it a dress? Oh my gosh, it is a dress. It's also from Lay Ami. This is really, really pretty. It's like one of those like patchwork, flowy. Ooh, I'm excited about this. What are these dresses called? I can't remember, but I actually really, really like these. Hopefully this color doesn't wash me out, but I think it'll be a cute little like neutral look. And I love dresses like this, like a, not flocked. What is it? What are they called? Why can I not think of it? But I really, really like it. It's a nice little long sleeve dress. So excited to try this one on. Y'all know I love a good dress. <gasps> oh my goodness. The next thing is from Paper Moon. And look at how cute this sweater is. <gasps> First of all, it has pom-poms on it. 
I'm obsessed. Second of all, it's like blanket material in the best way possible. I love this color of blue green, like an emeraldy color, and I love the pom poms. Probably have to be a little careful in the wash with those. Probably put it in like a um, like lingerie bag or like one of those wash bags. But oh, this is so so cute. I don't like have any pom pommy sweaters, and I'm like I actually really really like this one, and it feels so soft. Okay, I'm very excited. Um. I don't even think I mentioned what my stylist note was. I didn't give them much instruction because honestly, I don't, I don't really need a lot of clothes right now. But I asked for like some winter pieces or pieces to get me through like the colder seasons. So, loving that. Then from Commune, I have this. I think everything is probably in a size small. This is just a, calls it uniform blue v-neck long sleeve shirt. Really soft. It's a little see-through. These arms look very skinny, but I also have very skinny arms, so it probably works out well. It's a little bit see-through and it's very like thin, um, and it also is very long. I feel like this could be like a good, like a base layer, like under something piece. You could wear it on its own too, and I'm sure it's gonna be really cute. Um, this would look really pretty under the um, cardigan, though I think it might be, and it's two different blues, they might not work together. Um, but a really cute little blue long sleeve there. And last but not least, we have a pair of pants. We have a pair of blue pants. Look at these. Okay. Um, these are from Paris? Perig? Panig? Paris? I can't read it. <laughs> um, what size are these? I hope, yeah, these are a size four, which is my size. Do they have a real zipper? Yeah, they have a real zipper. They have real pockets. Okay. They're like a... They're a different material. What is What are these made out of? They are made of 63% viscose, 33% nylon, and 4% spandex. So they do have a different texture to them, but they're a fun blue pant. There's like a blue vibe going on in this box. I, um, I'm gonna try everything in this box on together. So hopefully, like, I don't know if the blues will clash or work, but um, a blue vibe, I'm not mad about it. It definitely feels like January snow, blue, white, you know what I mean? So I'm here for it. So. Let's try these things on and see what I think. Again, it's not like a mystery box. Well, it's kind of like a mystery box, honestly. It's like a clothing mystery box because you pay $95, you don't know what you're gonna get. You don't get like a preview where you get to pick and choose. So stuff shows up and then it's a fun little mystery box. So let's try it on. All right, off to a good start. So we have the blue pants on. I really like them. I feel like they make my butt look really good. They fit me really well. They're actually quite comfortable. I wasn't sure because of the material whether or not they'd actually feel comfortable on, and they do. The only problem with them for me is they're too long on me. They were going under my foot, so I've had to roll them up two times. Um, and I'm I'm five seven. I've never really had an issue with pants being too long. The only other time this has happened was like with a pair of pajama pants from Target once, but normally. I don't have any issues, so just FYI, the legs on these are really long, but again, this is like a mystery box, not a mystery box, a sale box, final sale, so I can't do anything about it, but actually, even rolled up, I think they're super duper cute. Uh, my mom sews, so I could have her bring it up if I wanted to. You could take it to a tailor if you so desired to have it you know, taken, but I actually don't mind the rolled up look. Um, then this shirt. Now, I, I'll be honest, I'm like, oh, this is like a boring basic shirt, but I think it's so cute, especially when it's like pulled down like that and it gives you that vibe. It's so soft. It's so comfortable. Um, I have really skinny arms, so for me, I think it looks good. If you're self-conscious about like the weight of your arms, this probably might highlight that. But for me, I really, really love this top. It's a very cute basic. Um, I feel like it looks, all of this kind of looks a little bit black on camera. I could be wrong, um, but it's blue. This together, I probably wouldn't wear these together because they're like close enough, but not close enough, if that makes sense. They're different, but they're they're a little too similar. But I actually really, really love the shirt. I, I was like, oh, just a basic, but I actually really, really like it. All right, I've gone ahead and thrown the cardigan on over it. I think the cardigan is super cute. That being said, I don't, I actually don't really wear a lot of cardigans. It's a fun thing to throw over when I'm working. This isn't something I'd wear out. I don't like the, the way cardigans look, on me at least, um, since I wear so many blazers. But that being said, it's super comfortable. I'll definitely wear this like around the house when I'm working. It'll still look somewhat professional. It's so soft and cozy. It is really long. So if you like kind of covering your rear end, this is absolutely great for that. Um, and actually, now when I put the three different blues together, I feel like it somehow then works. When you add in the third different blue, it actually kind of works as an outfit. So, could be a cute little moment there. 
All right, up next we have this sweater. I love this sweater. I had to do a little spin. Um, it's so cute. It's just a little basic sweater. It doesn't really go with the jeans. Like, it's, I love the blue theme, but they're different blues. And so I'll definitely wear this. Um, it's super comfy. It's like, this is a definitely like really warm type sweater. Like, it already can feel like getting warmer in it. And I just think it's so cute. I really, really love it. Super cute. I feel like there's not much to say about it because it's just, it's a cute little, little sweater. All right, and last but not least, the dress. I do think it's cute. It's giving a little bit Amish church conservative vibes. You know what I mean? Like it's a little bit like, but I still think it's really, really cute. You probably could belt it like where this seam is. And I don't know, like that might add a cute little element to it. Um, I, it is like my bra strap keeps coming out. So I would probably want to wear a different bra with this or do a little bit something different with it. But I think it's super cute and a flirty and fun. Um, wearing it is making me realize I need to shake my legs because when it's cold out, you know, your legs aren't out. So I got a little woolly beast down there, but um, the dress itself is super duper cute and fun. I definitely think this is something I would wear more in the springtime, um, not the winter time, just because of the material. But I think it's really, it is cute. It's really cute, um, depending on how you style it. I normally dress, I feel like this looks a little bit more mature. Like these dresses tend to look younger. I feel like this one is a more mature version of the dress, which I don't not like. It's just not what I was maybe expecting it to look like. Um, but I do think it is really cute. All right, back for final thoughts. I thought that was a pretty good. Um, for a box that you can't return anything, I'm happy to keep all of that. There's nothing in that where I'm like, Ooh, I'm not gonna use that, I'm gonna not be able to keep it. You know what I mean? Like everything is something that I will use. Um, I'm gonna be honest, my favorite thing in there was that long sleeve blue v-neck shirt. I really love that, but I, everything in here is definitely something that I'll wear. I'll wear. The dress is really cute. I thought it was fun, particularly because you don't get a preview. You don't get it. Like, I just feel like for me, that was pretty good. Um, and again, $95 for all of that, I feel like it's a pretty good price. You're technically, that's like $19 per item. But again, like shipping and everything right now is super expensive and you're getting yourself ship that ship for free. Plus you're getting the styling service based on what you ask for. So honestly, I think that's a pretty good price for the sale box. Um, I want to hear your thoughts. What do you think of the pieces that I got? Do you like them on me? Do you not like them on me? What do you think of it? Um, I think that Georgia's Sunshine did an unboxing and try on of this box as well. So if you want to see another one of these um, unboxings before you go and buy it, check hers out. Um, but I will definitely leave a link down below in case you want to sign up for one of these um, sale boxes. If you like this video, please make sure that you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on future uploads. And I'll see you in my next video.